Hi everyone, I'm George Haydock, General Manager for Pioneer International. What you're seeing here is a test that we did on three machines. Uh, an inverter Pioneer machine running on hydrocarbons, exactly the same inverter machine running on 410A, and an old fixed speed machine running on R22. We set them up in the factory at 20 degrees, 22 degrees, and we set the temperature at 16. As you can see here, from the first reading of the old R22 fixed speed machine, it's drawing 17 to 17.4 amps. What you're seeing here is the new inverter machine running on 410A and it's drawing between 7.8 to 8 amps. And the last one you're seeing here is, the, is our inverter machine running on hydrocarbon refrigerants. So it's drawing about 4.8 9 to 5 amps and all of these machines are running at the same time in exactly the same atmosphere. Okay, so what we're looking at is this old fixed speed machine that's running on R22 refrigerant. It was drawing 17.3 amps. And then when we move across to the new Pioneer inverter machine running on 410A, it was drawing 7.8 amps. So the difference in that is around about 54% energy saving. That's large. But then when we move across to the last machine, which is the same inverter, the same Pioneer inverter, but running on hydrocarbon refrigerants, the energy save, the, the energy use is 4.9, which gives us an energy saving of 71%. That's huge. But even if we look at the energy saving with the refrigerant change from 410 to PI60 or the hydrocarbon, that's an energy saving in inverter machines of 37%, huge.